What's cracking, yo? Welcome back to Boo TV. Appreciate you for stopping in. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, stay notified, and let's get into the topic for today. Another Larry Bird reaction video coming your way. This one was recommended to us by Jimmy Boy 131 about to get into an OG basketball player, um, Jamal Mashburn, who's pretty pretty good player. I, I watched Jamal play most of his career. Jamal Mashburn, what a cool Larry Bird story. I have not seen this video before. Real raw reaction coming at you. If you're interested in more Larry Bird content, check out our Larry Bird playlist and our reaction video playlist for all our reaction videos. All right, appreciate you. Let's check this out. To play against the dream team. This was the legendary game where the college guys came in and Chuck Daly let y'all tear their ass up and as soon as y'all started getting back, he ended it, right? So yeah, so funny. So when we got an invitation, it was eight of us. It was myself, Bobby Hurley, Alan Houston. Alan Houston. Uh, Chris Webber, Rodney Rogers, Eric Montrose. Shout out Eddie Rodney Martin. Rogers, man. Shout yeah. out to OG. Yeah. And um, and Grant Hill was on that squad. Ooh. So we get to La Jolla, San Diego, and we check into the Marriott. We go up to our floor, and we're walking in the corridor, and we see this tall white guy coming down the hall. And I'm like, damn, that looked like Larry Bird. <laughs> so Larry Bird coming down the hallway, me and Chris Webber, and Larry Bird, you don't realize how big Larry Bird is until you stand yeah, up close oh, to Larry yeah. Bird. Exactly, as a guy. Yeah. Man. Larry Bird, legit 6'10". Larry nah, Larry real talk. Yeah. When I yeah. first yeah. stood up against him when he was real coaching talk. the face, I was like, damn. So he, he walked by us and he says, y'all those college guys? And we was like, yeah, 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 we the college guys. And he looked at us and he said, get some fucking rest. It's gonna be a long week and walked off. And we was like, what the hell? Larry. <laughs> what y'all got us in? Yeah, I'm like, okay. You know, we like, all right, what's going I, on here? I wanted to say what's up. And he just <laughs> came to me like this, like, dang. Yeah. So the next morning, we get up and we go to um, practice. And Roy Williams is our coach. But we only got eight. So we like, well, how are we practicing? And what are we practicing for? So we spent, I want to say, an hour doing the three-man weave. And I'm like, what's going on here? <laughs> then they bus us to another location where the dream team is practicing. And these about 400 people standing outside uh, waiting for the dream team to come out. They take us up to a top floor and the dream team is practicing. They're finishing up their practice. And then they say, all right, get loose and stretch out. We're like, okay, we playing? They're like, yeah, yeah, we're gonna play next. So we get out the gates like the first 15 minutes, we kicking they ass. <laughs> we, but we running them all out, Bobby Hurley in the lane, killing John Stockton. So they stopped the game and turn off the score. I think we were up like 72, 66 or something, 64 or something like that. They just stopped the game. So we like, all right, was this halftime or some shit? They like, nah, the press coming in. So I'm like, oh, oh, wow. So that's when the, the the thing came out that Chuck Daly let us win. Cause they didn't, they they were like, they didn't want to hold a complete game because they knew it was going to be downhill from there. Cause we were trying to prove that we could yeah, represent yeah. the country. Yeah. So we we um lit their ass up and then some happened. We're sitting there and we get back to the hotel Rodney Rogers says something to, it's a group of them. It's Larry Bird, Magic Johnson, and everybody's shooting the shit. And Rodney Rogers said, hey, Larry, you ain't hit a jumper since 84. <laughs> Magic heard that shit. And we ain't think nothing of it. The next day we came in and I never seen this. And this one I was like, this is a different breed. Magic Johnson fed Larry Bird the ball probably about eight times in a row down court. Larry Bird got the ball on Rodney Rogers and every time he was about to make a move, he told him what he was going to do. One dribble, pull up, going left, off glass. <laughs> Fuck it. One dribble, going right, spin, shot, bucket. He scored nine times or eight times in a row 
left the court to go lay down because he couldn't sit on a bench. He had to lay down because of his back. back. And said, young fella, look like 84, huh? (laughs) (laughs) Last time he made. (laughs) (laughs) So I'm sitting there and I'm like, wow. I said, so that's, 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 they kicked our ass for the rest of the week. Young fella, look like 84, huh? Listen, boy, Magic, ooh, ooh, you know how crazy that sound? Magic Johnson fed Larry Bird the ball. That's deadly, bro, that's deadly. You got Magic setting up Larry, oh. Larry call it like we've heard many stories before. Larry Bird just calling out what he gonna do. Tell, I'm gonna tell you exactly where I'm gonna, I'll tell you exactly where I'm gonna be on the court, the exact spot. I'm gonna tell you exactly what I'm gonna do. And you still ain't gonna stop me. Larry Bird could talk that shit, and Larry Bird would back that shit up a thousand and one times over again. That was a dope story. Jamal Mashburn, uh, he's a pretty good storyteller. He's a pretty good storyteller. I like how he, uh, you know, how he how he put that out. Good flow, good everything, good good pacing, a great story all together. They thought they was doing something against the dream team. Jokers turned the score, turned the score off. Press coming in. Talking that shit, talking that shit, got they ass waxed the rest of the week. Yeah, people and people really don't really Larry Bird is legit six eight, six nine, probably six nine. I think I've been on record saying six eight before, but probably solid six nine. Cause, cause, could do everything. Could do everything. Everything. <laughs> shit, man. Uh I wish I wish I wish they had the cameras rolling. I, I would have loved to see that. And they had Grant Hill on that squad too. Man, Grant Hill, people don't realize Grant Hill, had it not been for injuries, Grant Hill very well probably could have been a top 10 player of all time. That's how elite Grant Hill was. They had G Hill, Nash, Houston. I want to I wanna know who the rest of the players were on that squad playing against a dream team. Bird, knocking them out the park, baby. Ooh, calling calling each part of the move too. What he said, one step left, spin, one shot, dribble, something like that. Calling each segment out of the move, crazy, crazy. Appreciate you guys. Let me know if you heard this story. If you got any cool Larry Bird stories, if it's anything personal, you know, let me know in the comment section. I read all the comments, respond to them. I would love to hear your story and uh, provide more context to the legend that is Larry Bird. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, stay. Notified. Catch you on the next one.